hey what's up guys this is Rakesh and today we are going to learn how to add and customize input field field label okay and also some output field too so what is input field these are the input fields and these are the labels right and click on the and click on this view field link and these are the list of all the field label okay and these are the field name and this is the data type so we're going to use this right now back to our page this is the page name that is called custom labels this is the id of one of record of this contact because we are going to use the standard controller of contact okay save this and here we go now there are lots of other tags we are going to use so just remember everyone okay first of all we add apex form tag okay and everything goes inside these two tags now it's time to add apex uh, page block okay and in the opening tag of page block give the title like uh, what we do mm, quick edit quick edit and then right here contact dot name save this and now quick edit just tabish okay now it's time to add something more that is called apex page block block section okay and this is the new tag page block section and after that add a new thing new tag that is called apex page block buttons okay now what in goes inside this page block buttons is the apex uh, command button okay and give the value to save and um, action what it does actually just write save we are going to use the standard control contact so it just call the save method of this standard controller of contact okay save this and here we go though so as there are these buttons are there just like that we also have this button on the top and the bottom okay now uh, we have done this apex page block button section okay now it's time for apex page block section okay so if we want to write uh, the button input command button okay inside this page block button then it automatically uh, do one thing that is called it just fit on the standard layout okay so in that there is save button and in the uh, footer there is also save button so it does like exactly like that okay now uh, what uh, this page block section does okay so any input field or some output field we write inside or between this uh, opening tag and closing tag of page block section it automatically get the label which is a default label such as here this label okay to here right let me tell you you can also see it here so i'm gonna to add the first input field that is called apex input field and the value of this field is like uh, contact contact dot mm, phone save this and here we go phone all right so this is the input field and this is the label all right if i add a one more input field uh, this time I'm going to use the output field or okay? apex output field and give the value to something called contact dot mobile phone okay save this and here we go there's only a output field but there's no label because why because 
the output field tag is outside the page block section if I uh, cut it and paste it inside this page block section tag and save this then here we go the mobile label which is a default label okay the default one as you can see from here also there's a mobile yeah for mobile phone there's a mobile okay so it comes with that so uh, it does page block section does that uh, the labels also display with the fields okay so give um, another title to this page block section like what we write mm, not simple right contact details okay save this and here we go so this is actually a page block section okay and there is one more functionality that is called if you click here the triangle the details gonna hide and then again click on this then it will show so this is one more feature of this apex page block section and next is it automatically have all these fields okay now it's time to add one more um, input field or we call a new tag that is called uh, apex input text okay uh, give the value again as uh, contact dot email okay save this and now the email all right now there is two columns how we can make this in one single column so mobile also comes here for that in page block section we need to add one more attribute that is called columns and site double quote write one save this and here we go only in one column all the fields are coming now it's time to change these labels for that we need to do a simple attribute label equals uh, my phone number and then right here um, again label and my mobile phone number and if you want just save it to see the reflection here we go all this have changed now and in the email for email I'm going to use the expression tag also so just write label and now we are going to use this expression tag so right here contact dot name so the name will display okay after that we need to do one thing that we are going to concat one more name as in text like um, uh, single quote and write emails okay and save this now um, make some space and save this here we go George Dev is the name coming from this okay and the email as simple text okay you also write your apostrophe is s okay so that's it for now here yeah, in this way we can write all these things and we can also change it from here okay for now thank you bye bye see you in the next video